Hi there. Are you looking to add individual or multiple contacts to an already established group in our MXD platform? In this video, we'll be showing you how to do so. Now that you're logged in, go to the left hand side of your screen and select the Send Messages item in the menu. From here, select the Contact Lists item from the menu that has appeared. Here, you will find contact lists that you've already created. Here we have our test example titled Test 1. We currently have no contacts within our contact list, so let's add one. For this, we have two options. We can add contacts individually or import large volumes of contacts to the assigned list. Let's start by importing a large volume of contacts to our group labelled Test 1. To do so, first select the Import button at the top of your screen. Before importing a file, it's important to remember that all files created in Excel must be saved in .csv or .xls formats. We've gone ahead and prepared our own, but if you wish to learn more about how to format your spreadsheet, see the related videos. When you're ready, select the Numbers box, click Select File and add in your document of choice. For this example, we will add September Contacts as our selected file. Now to select a list. As we already had an example list stored from a previous video, which looked at creating a new contact list, we will select Test 1 and continue. As we are importing contacts for the first time, you don't have to worry about resetting contacts that have previously opted out. But if this is a follow-up campaign, remember to select the Reset Contacts that have previously opted out box before continuing if you wish to exclude them. Now we are ready to assess the spreadsheet details. Click Next. Here we have a chance to review our columns and appropriately match up the spreadsheet data. At the top of our page, you'll see the first few rows of our spreadsheet are shown for reference. Based on the spreadsheet provided, you will see possible matches. After matching these, let's select Next. Your data is now ready to import. Have a read over your content and ensure your spreadsheet column mapping is all correct. It's also important to note that it can take up to several minutes to import large spreadsheets of data. Once you are happy with your review, select Import. After importing your list's contacts, you may have realised that you have left one out, or you may want to simply add a new contact. This can easily be done. All you need to do is to select the contact list you wish to add the individual contact to. Continuing on from our example, let's select Test 1. To add an additional contact, select the COG drop-down, then click Add Contact. Here, you can add in personal details about your contact. You can add in as much or as little information as you wish. Just remember that a contact phone number is necessary. Begin with a mobile number, remembering that it's always best to use the country code prefix at the start of your number to avoid any confusion. Follow up with email and family name information if required. Enter the email address for your contact, a family and given name, and a display or nickname to make it easier for you. All you need to do now is click Add Contact and you're ready to get sending. And that's it. Everything you need to know about importing contacts to lists in MXT. Make sure you check out our related videos for more great tips on how to utilise the power of MXT for your marketing campaigns. If you do require any further assistance, please don't hesitate to contact us at info at or give us a call on 1300 883 400. SMS Global. It's a mobile world.